Crafting a smithy. Metal ingots, stone, wood, and hide. Mix them together in a large bowl. Oh, hi, friends. Thanks for joining us today. What's going on, everybody? It's Monkey Farm. We are back for another episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooping Evolve server. Uh, as you can see, I have tamed a Pteranodon. It's level 116 at the moment. Uh, I've been flying around, doing some hunting, and just checking out the whole scenery. Uh, it's awesome to, to have a bird now. Uh, I have a few of these, actually, but this is my, this is my killer hunter. Whoa, what was that? Um, this guy is level 116, and I believe his peak will be around 140-ish. Uh, so we're doing a little bit better than our previous tames, you know, with the with the dilos. Uh, let me get back to regular mode here. Wait, where is everything? All right. Uh, let's. I've also been raiding some of these item drops as well. Uh, that one's not down yet, but uh, so I've been upgrading this guy. Uh, he's health over a thousand, you know, 1100, 1080 stamina. And I've been boosting the melee damage a little bit as well. Uh, this guy is going to be our our long range hunter, stamina killer kind of guy. All right, so I want to give you guys a little demo of what my little bird can do here. Uh, let's see if we have if we have a weak parasaur, um, a dilo, or maybe another pteranodon that's kind of low level, like 50 or below. Um, we can pretty much take those out in one hit. Let's see. Okay. Oh, we got a double hit. We did get one one of the dilos we took out in that one hit. And then... There. And we got... Ooh. <laughs> we killed a raptor level 12 in one hit. It's uh, pretty awesome. Oh, is there another one right there? All right. Let's just... Let's just knock him out. Go. Um, let's see. Take that one out. Oh yeah! Take another one out. Oh, we missed. Fail. All right. Let's see. If we can do it. There we go. Level four. Oh, that was an easy one. But yeah, this bird. This bird is super awesome. I'm loving it. I'm gonna keep boosting the melee damage, the stamina, the health. Um, you know, maybe wait a little bit just so I can carry around. You know, I've got. Uh, I've got a bunch of spoiled prime meat that has kind of, you know, gone bad and everything. Uh, another thing I need to do in the meantime is also get some... I've got a ton of Ingram points that I need to start using. And I want to start getting into some of the metal. I have the Ingrams for these. Um, and maybe even... Hmm, let's see. Something else. Uh, but I want to I want to make a metal pick and a hatchet and everything because uh, I need some crystals and stuff I need uh, I want to make a spyglass so I can zoom in to animals from far away up here on my bird and see Like what level they're at like if I'm searching for a specific animal of really high level like let's say I wanted a stego of, of you know a hundred and something stego well, I could just um, with Without having to fly up real close to the animal and risk, you know well stegos don't attack but uh, see, so yeah, normally I'd have to fly up and see, ooh, should we, um, should we attack this, this Pteranodon and see if we can take it out in one hit? Let's do it. Nope, not one hit. Let's see, where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, is he trying to escape over there? We're running low on stamina, but we might be able to catch him. Let's see. One more pass. Whoa. Whoa. What was that? There we go. Two barrel rolls in the air, and he's dead meat. So I need some better tools because my current tools, my stone pick, can't actually harvest crystals or anything. So um, I need better tools, basically. So we need to do some of that. All right, so now we're in the smithy, and we can see that, oh, I actually have enough to craft a metal pick. Uh, do I have metal here? I probably have some metal in here somewhere that I don't even know about. Um, there's probably a couple pieces in here I could borrow. Oh, there's there's one piece there. How much do I need? Uh, just one metal ingot, hide, and oh, so I can already get a metal pick here. 
and I can get a metal hatchet as well. So why don't we go ahead and do that? And uh, let's take our new awesome bird. Oh, why don't we why don't we make a spyglass too? Well, I really the whole point of this, I guess, was to to go get crystals and make a spyglass. But um, technically, we've already got the uh, there's a crystal here. Let's see how many how many crystals I need. Uh, spyglass, I need fiber, t wood, and I need two crystals. So that's pretty easy. I can handle that. Um, let's take two of those crystals. We've got some fiber here. And then we need... What else did we need? Uh, just hide in wood, which... Um, let's see, I don't need that much. I don't hardly need anything. Um, and now I just need a little bit of wood. So let me show you how much better these tools are. The metal stone and hatchet. When we go chop down a tree with this, you're not going to believe how much more materials we get. It's super awesome. Whoa, somebody tamed a little dimorphodon. These things are crazy looking. All right, I'm just going to head right outside the base here. And we're going to check out our new axe. Look at all that wood. It's it's going to totally encumber me because it's gonna, I'm going to be collecting so much wood. Um, obviously, the other thing we can do... Yeah, I'm already encumbered, so check that out. Um, so let's craft... What did we need for the spyglass? Where's our spyglass ingram? Can we do that here, or did we need the smithy for that? We need... Oh, we need hide. I thought I grabbed some hide. Anyway, well, let's go back inside and craft up this thing here real quick. By the way, I'm really glad you guys are enjoying this series. Oh, we just leveled up. Sweet. Uh, let's take out the spyglass here. And where can we put this? I guess in number 10. I don't... I haven't been using a torch very much recently. Um, so let's go outside. Oh, I need to dump some of my inventory. All right, we're up here in Get Poop Pteranodon. And I guess I just have to push zero and... Okay, there we go. So we can just zoom in right here and see what level these, uh, these animals are. And whoa, I don't know how to... Let's see. Can I do that without zooming in? Yep, I can. Okay. This thing actually zooms in quite a bit, so it's a little... It's a little tough to use if you're not used to it, but I guess if you kind of zoom in the right area. See, there's a level 16. Um, why don't we head up... Actually, you know what? Why don't I take you up the mountain real quick? And there should be some crystals on top of... I don't know if that's the volcano or if, if there's a different volcano. But I think there are some crystals on top of that mountain right there. So I'm going to zoom up a little bit. And we will fly up there and check out our new pick. All right, here we go. We're in the um, the little crater here. And looks like there aren't any other animals around. So we're, we're safe at the moment. So let's test out this new pick of ours. Oh, yes, crystals. Beautiful. So I came up here before. And uh, I had tried it with my stone pick, not knowing that I, that I couldn't actually break these. Um, but that is super cool. I'm glad now we've got some real, we've got some real materials here. And why don't we also let's see what's better, what's better for metal, the axe or the pick? Let's see. Um, ooh, looks like the pick. Look at all that metal. We're gonna be encumbered here really quick here. Oh my gosh. So yeah, we're we're gonna have tons of metal. We're not gonna be able to carry all this. I'm just gonna break one one block. Yeah, I'm totally, I totally can't move. Uh, I wish I had, I wish I was right next to my bird. Um, I could get rid of these. Oh, I could get rid of this stone. Why don't I do that? Because stone, I can get a little more easy. Whoa, am I stuck? Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm way too heavy. Come here, bird. Come here. Um, I wonder if I can call him over here to me. Is he going to fly over here? Oh, get over here bird come here there we go am i too heavy for the bird to move yeah um let's see if we can 
let's see if we can transfer some of this inventory to the bird and um, and maybe he can fly a little bit better nope this is just way too heavy check out check out the weight here oh weight 300 oh this is horrible oh we've got to get we've got to get a gigantic bird up here to carry some of this metal then i guess uh 227 he's still too heavy oh man so can i maybe fly now nope i'm still encumbered ah I was all excited to get all this metal. Um, I guess I'll leave some of the metal on the bird and then just drop some of it out of my inventory instead. Um, can that can we move now? Yeah, we can't we can't move very quickly at all. This would be a really bad situation if we had an Arge an RG um, come up and try to attack us or something. So why don't I figure this out and uh, I'll see you guys back at the base. Hello, people. I think I have some bad news for you. I pushed the wrong button and jumped off my bird in mid-air, and I landed on a rock somewhere down here. Now I'm on my other bird with no inventory whatsoever, trying to find my dead body, or at least the... the the little package where all my inventory might be and I have no idea where it is and it's raining and I can't see anything so <laughs> um, this is slightly worse than than rolling back a day of inventory this is rolling back pretty much everything I own uh, I do have levels and everything and I have community animals that I can go out and gather materials with. But man, this is this is really discouraging that that I can't find and I'm freezing too, <laughs> as you can see. Uh what I don't know is when your body lands, does it roll down the mountain or does it kind of stay where it landed? Cause that that would that would change whether I need to check like around this level of the mountain ah oh, be quiet you're cold i get it i understand you're gonna die you're freezing um yeah because i don't know this is really a gigantic mountain and there's no way i'm i really know where i'm supposed to check for my body if it's gonna like if it slides down the mountain or if it's like where it lands so anyway um wish me luck Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, I found my bird. Oh, let's see, can I get off my bird and pick this up though? That is the trick. Oh gosh, I gotta get over here, I gotta get over here. How do I get over here? Oh please don't slide down the mountain, please don't slide down the mountain. Is that all my stuff? Okay, move, 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 oh man, alright, I got it, I gotta get, uh, oh, I am so happy I found my stuff, but now I have to, yeah, now I have to pick it up. Okay, please don't slide down the mountain. Please don't slide down the mountain. Please get out of my way. Oh, we're so close. Take all inventory. Oh, yes. Okay, ride. Who are we riding? Okay, get pooped on. Follow us home. Or get pooped terrared on. Ter okay, we're going slow because we have inventory. But um, I've been eating raw meat that I've been trying to kill. Oh, man, I hope... Um, let me get rid of some of, what can I move, or get rid of, let's see, weight is 130, this guy, okay, hide pants, drop, cloth boots, drop, oh, here's cooked meat, that'll help me out, um, I could get rid of these door frames and stuff, okay, we're able to speed up a bit, oh, Oh man, you guys don't know how worried I was. I was so, so afraid that all my stuff <laughs> was gone. And my favorite bird. 
Get pooped on. Get pooped on. That's that's short for get pooped pterodon or pterodon. But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna call him get pooped on for short. Okay, well I'm gonna end it here. Now that my heart can stop beating, it took me probably 30 minutes at least to search and I finally went off to the other side of the mountain that I hadn't searched yet because I didn't think I actually fell down that side. I thought it was the other side. Oh, wow. Okay, people. Well, I'm glad you got to meet, get pooped on behind me there. I'm so happy. I'm so happy we found him and we didn't lose all our inventory. So that's a good a good end to a crazy day here on Ark Survival. Please sum up the video if you enjoyed it. And um <laughs> and we will see you next time.